supernatural force intervenes. I go home, I get on my hands and knees, and I say, God, if you're real, change my life, or I'm gonna kill myself. Because I thought, like, man, like, I'm 18 years old, and I'm making more than my teachers in high school, and I felt like, <laughs> what is the point of this? Like, you know, what am I gonna do, buy a nicer car? A, a lot of my mentors, they were depressed. One dude had a very nice sports car, and he was even telling me after, you know, about two months of having it, he it didn't, there's no feeling associated with it anymore. I remember in that moment when I prayed that, my aunt, Cindy, she was the only, like, Christian in our Christian family. She would always, like, talk about Jesus, heaven, and hell. We all thought she lost her mind. <laughs> she, remember, in that moment, didn't talk to her, and God knows how long. She sends me a text that says, you're trying to find fulfillment in the things of this world, but it will never work without a relationship with Jesus Christ. And I literally start bawling. This, this, this is this, as I prayed that prayer, yeah. I get a text by her. This was, this was your aunt. 